Hey guys, I wanted to record a trade today. Um, this reversal pattern I was trying to set up here. Unfortunately, it just went straight up and it never looked back. Um, so uh, what I saw so far, the overnight was range bound and then the open is somewhere in here. We had a what I saw was a, a spike down going into a channel. Um, you can also make this a two-tier channel and maybe put the second tier up here from that high up there. Um, that gives you the break here at the new low and then another push down, which we've been seeing a lot, um, you know, making the low and then having that extra push before we reverse. Uh, so it doesn't really matter. You can, you can have it here. You can have it here with a midline. Um, I'm going to keep it here. Um, this this looks this looks correct to me. Break the first attempt to go lower. This is the second attempt to go lower. I was not at the screen for this, um, nor am I sure I would have taken this. I got burnt on a trade like this yesterday, where price went through the EMA on a second entry short like this. Um, so I probably would not have taken this today. And we're also kind of stacking up sideways here. So it's a shame. It was a beautiful trade. It was a second entry short. Um, like I said, I wasn't at the screen and I wouldn't have taken it. So now we have a break of this up channel. So um, I'm going to go long here uh, if this um, when this bar closes. Um, it's It looks like it's going to be a bullish bar. I'm going to wait for it to tick higher. And I'm going to drop my limit order in at the high of this bar. So let's uh, let's get ready here. Okay. There we go. Uh, and we're going to get left behind, it looks like, huh? I don't know what is going on. All right, our limit order is in at... Order filled. And we're filled. We're filled at 25.25. There's plenty of room for our stop. I'm expecting to retest this high. Um... There's also some prior support resistance at this level right here that we bounced right off of. It is a first entry, um, but since we bounced right off the EMA, um, I do like I do like the entry. So let's see how let's see how this works out. Um, it's two contracts. You can see that here. Um, the first contract comes off at at a point at four ticks. If we get there. And um, at five ticks, we then go to break even with the second contract going off at at three points, and we can we can we can adjust that contract as we see fit if we get there. It looks like our target filled. Get out. Um, we're at break even now. Um, I'm going to I'm going to leave at this second contract where it is for now. Um, this looks. We could get a second leg up here. Let's see. Uh, let's see how this. Uh, let's see how this plays out. This is. This is a strong move. Um, since this is the first trade of the day, I will be happy with. Um, with. Um, I would be happy with three points right here. Um, to be honest, I would be happy with two points. Um, we're actually there's resistance right up here, so I'm gonna come just a little bit below this. Um, th th there, th you can see at the overnight, and this is probably also the midpoint of this range. So I'm gonna come, uh, I'm gonna come two ticks below it, actually like this. So that would give us uh, two and a half, which we just had a minute ago. But um, our stop at this point is. Um, is that uh, is one tick below this last bar? Um, we we are a little far from the EMA, so you know maybe it would have been wise to <laughs> take profits up here. But you know uh, you're always smarter in hindsight. I think if we get back up to two points, I think I will get out. Um, I don't like I don't like it backing up right here. So we'll we'll either get tagged or. We'll get our we'll get our two two and a half points. Um, Target filled. I'm going to take what I can get on this. 
uh, I just didn't see, it didn't seem like it was going in my direction. Um, regardless, 100 bucks, um, first trade of the day. Again, uh, strong up move on a reversal pattern. It is the first pullback, but I liked it since it was a very bullish bar right off the EMA, right off the support resistance. Um, so I took it, I took a point, uh, I took four ticks and five ticks on um, the runner. We would have gotten tagged here, as you can see, unless we left our, unless we left it at uh, at break even, of course. Um, but you know, if you go to two points or two and a half points, you know, you got to bring your stop. Well, you don't have to, but I bring my stop up. So that's that's what I did. Um, hopefully, this is of value.